Bismillah, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah, dan kasih rontoi bantu bar kafi kama yuhibur robbuna wa yardo. Syadu Allah, ilai Allah, wa syadu anna Muhammad dan Abdi wa Rasulullah amma ba'du. In this uh, project, I will uh, show and explain about shirk. So, what is shirk actually? Shirk is an intention or act uh, that equates something uh, other than Allah uh, and relies on Allah in terms of rububiyah, uluhiyah, and huluyah. Generally, uh, partner in uh, uluhiyah Allah are things uh, that are specific to Allah, such as praying to other than Allah. Or turning away from uh, worship, such as slaughtering, uh, sacrifice, making vows, praying, and so on, other than him. Uh, there is two type of shirk, yeah. Origin of Tau. In Surah al in verse 19, Allah gives sample of the idea of God other than him. God made it clear. Uh, he had that he had no children and had no part of as God. God assumes or Allah assumes the existence of Allah in large number. This is to this situation will only cause chaos for the begins created by this this God this God will overcome this, this God. The gods will overcome each other. At end of verse, Allah declares that He is the most holy, this attribute. Shirk can arise in the mind of two groups. First group uh, is the one who imagines the, an agreement between two gods. While the second group is the one who imagine dispute between two gods. But grubs believe in their own toes. They think that the group that wins be, will be superior to the group that loses. God who loses will again hold a test of trench. If he wins, uh, then the position of tops and bottoms become opposite. This god who finally won the became government for the defeat god. Okay, sorry, this is a slide about what is shirk. And next is there is greater shirk. So, in general, shirk is classified into two groups uh, namely, greater shirk and lesser shirk. Greater shirk can remove the perpetrator uh, from Islam and make him eternal in hell if he dies and has not repent to Allah. Great shirk is turning away from worship to other than Allah, such so praying to other than Allah or getting close, closer to Him by sorcery or sacrifice or false for other than Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, whether for grabs, jinn, or devil, or helping something other than Allah, uh, which is unable to provide uh, benefits as well as harm. The shirk of form. First is shirk of prayer. Okay, wait. Uh, shirk of prayer that is beside praying to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He also pray to other than him. Second is shirk of intention. Desires and goals. That is uh, shows an act of worship for other Allah. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Shirk of the ends, namely obeying other than Allah in case of this option to Allah. Shirk mahabbah, the last, or love. Uh, that is equating other uh, than Allah with Allah in matter of love. The second is lesser shirk. Lesser shirk does not make the preparator out of Islam, but it is monotheism and is a wasila for example swearing uh wasila intermediary for great shirk form of 
of lesser shirk. Uh, there is only one shirk zahir, real, namely lesser shirk, uh, in the form of words and deeds, in the form of speech, for example, swearing by name other than Allah. Uh, uh, example, you swearing, uh, Wallahi and uh, Fulan uh, is a uh, lesser shirk, shirk zahir. Rasulullah said, uh, whoever swears by name other than Allah, then he has committed kufr or shirk. Hadis history at the number, number uh, 1535. Al-Hakim, chapter 1, uh, number 18, from Abdullah bin Umar radiallahu an shirk in the form of speech namely the word if not for will Allah and will of so and so Quran and Quran saying is wrong like one is if not for the will Allah then for the will of Quran like that yeah. that is the uh, right one the word then shows sequential order which means uh, making the will of servant follow the will of Allah. The next is uh, okay. So the next is ways to protect yourself from shirk. Okay, so there is four points to protect yourself from shirk. Four oh five five. First is sin worship. Sin worship. Only for Allah Azza wa Jalla by always trying to purify mountain. Second is pursuing sorry knowledge. Third is recognizing the effect of shirk and realizing that shirk will lead prepared to eternal life in hell. Wipe out good deeds. Deeds. The fourth is realizing that shirk Akbar will not forgiven by Allah unless repenting. And the fifth is not make friends with stupid people who include indulge in various form of shirk so beware of shirk in our forms and now the shirk can take from words words action and believe sometimes a single word uh, can disturb person's life in this world and the hereafter when he is not aware of it Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Do you know what your Lord said? They, the companion said, Allah and his messenger know best. He said, This morning some of my servants believe, and some disbelieve in me. Uh, this, those who say, We have received the gift of praying by virtue of Allah and his mercies. Then it is those uh, who believe in me and disbelieve in the star. Uh, as this will say, we get rain because of this or that consolation. Then that is the one who disbelieve in me and believe in star. Okay, uh, thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Basically, uh, humans uh, have to mature to really share. Man knows that the partners of Allah that he made not create any creature. Humans also know that this less cannot create the heaven. The earth, the earth, or the rain, this fitrah is explained by Allah in his word in Surah Al-Baqarah, verse 22. Humans commit shirk as a result of their desire of to obtain unrestricted freedom. The existing, the existing fitrah uh, then tries to be eliminated by the shirk in order to prevent him from obeying the commands and prohibition from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.